Apparently my BF is not a real man because he went to go watch a cat movie with me. My BF has this friend they're not close at all who is one of those wannabe alphas. My BF asked me to go to the movies and was originally gonna see if I wanted to watch Barbie or Oppenheimer with him definitely gotta watch Barbie sometime too after the posts I've seen on here. But he saw that there was also a kid's movie about a cat at our cinema and because I absolutely love cats. He wanted to go see that together. When my BF told his friend about that, he made fun of him for not being a real man because that movie just isn't manly enough apparently. And said he would never make such a fool of himself for a woman. He's single. I wonder why. Like honestly sir, that attitude is why you don't get pussy smh. Oh yes. Definitely more manly to sit in alone masturbating than making your girlfriend happy. He would never make such a fool of himself for a woman. Something tells me he doesn't get many opportunities to regardless. I'm getting massive insult vibes from this dude bro. Some of the manliest men I know absolutely melt at the sight of cute things. This guy is such a tool lmfao. The only answer to people like this is sonething like if you think that watching a movie, however girly it is, is going to make you less of a man. You might not be as manly as you think. He made fun of him for not being a real man because that movie just isn't manly enough apparently. And said he would never make such a fool of himself for a woman. Your boyfriend should clap back with at least I have girlfriend to be fool for. You just lonely fool with nothing. Anyone who talks about being an alpha is not one. And had severely deluded themselves by listening to a pickup artist. BF's friend should worry more about being a happy person who can find joy within himself. Because all he's worried about right now is what other people think of him. I love this sub. As a dad with a daughter I've seen countless girly movies. Had tea parties. And was the subject of nail painting practice. All happily. I promise you you've got the beginnings of a good man there. The friend is the one with issues. I'd say a fool already. Keep being awesome together. He's good. And so are you for pointing out how odd the friend's comments were. Okay. There's my one comment in this sub as an outside. Yal Twoxes keep being awesome. My BF loves cats and baby animals more than me. So, your acquaintance sounds like a real knucklehead. Was it The Amazing Morris? That movie is awesome and based on a book by Terry Pratchett who's a fantastic comic author. I dragged a bunch of reluctant friends to go see it with me and everyone loved it. My brother and his friends were the ones who introduced me to the whole How to Train Your Dragon franchise and a group of men at work are currently super excited about their long weekend trip to Euro Disney next month. Almost feel sorry for your boyfriend's friend. If he's so insecure he can't cope with the thought of doing anything not manly he's going to miss. Out on so much fun. It's manly to watch what you want to watch. How ridiculous of him to make fun of your boyfriend for making you happy. Clearly that's a foreign concept to him. My BF used to do roofing. He just went on a two-week backpacking trip through mountains in Washington. He's always the first to do yard work at his mom's. He got a manicure with me last week and is excited to go back and try and pedicure. It's almost essay person with varied interests and no one singular interest defines him thinking face. Lol. I wonder what he would have said if you had watched Barbie together. What's the name of the cat movie? So when I took my ex-fiancé to see Madagascar. 
mostly because of the penguins. That automatically made me not manly. Doesn't matter we drove there in a car my own hands, added 200 horsepower to. I was in an extreme metal band. Or that I drove lift trucks for a living and still do. I really hate bullshit like that. Not every guy cares about manly. Some of us just like what we like regardless of perceived gender norms. ISTG these toxic males will find the weirdest shit not masculine. Like apparently is not masculine to shower. Like WTF. Making decisions based on what you think looks manly is the least manly thing a guy could do. Or. Your BF seems like a sweetie imagine someone thinking he's less than cause he wanted to spend time. With his GF. If it makes him feel better. He's not alone. We do a backyard movie night once a month and everyone takes turns picking. Usually an 80s movie we're old lol. The last two the guys picked though were Shrek and How to Train a Dragon. Best to not try to make any sense of something as illogical as these misogynist creeps. They are acting entirely on emotions and not logic or reason. And yeah. Easy to see why he's single. I've been mocked for having profile photos with a cat on my shoulders. Like. What? Tough guys don't own cats either. Apparently. I've also gotten shit for not taking advantage of a drunk friend who was hanging all over me. Because. Apparently that's what real men are supposed to do. It's a sad and pathetic culture. Having fun is not manly these days El Mafo. Real men are so secure in their own masculinity that they can see any chick flick or children's movie. Some even buy he DVD to see them again and again. Ironically, he's already made a fool of himself. What was this cat film and was it any good? BF is interested lol. My sister's abusive ex-husband continually told her and others that my husband wasn't a real man. My husband respects, adores and cherishes me. He's empathetic and kind and intelligent. He treats me like an equal. He is also an absolute cat daddy and is so loving with our cats and all other animals. Shaw says a lot about my sister's ex that he thinks those qualities are ones to be derided. He appears to think that real men are those like him someone who is verbally, emotionally and sexually abusive. So glad my sister got out of that relationship. Hi. Grown ass. Straight cis male here. I'm a man. And want to watch a movie about cats. What movie is this? P.S. Your BF's friend sounds like a real winner. Can you give him this trophy for me? Trophy. Fellas. Is it gay to go on a date with my girlfriend? Jesus these men are as amusing as they are bullheaded and frustrating. Real men watch whatever the fuck they want without thinking it makes them less manly. See now I would say that having the confidence to do whatever he likes. And not caring about what other people think of him makes your boyfriend a real man. I wonder what this idiot friend of his would make of that. What's the name of the movie? Is it widely available or is it only showing in your hometown cinema? Sorry for the strange questions. I'm a big cat fan. When you care for someone you do things for their sake. So you might go to a concert of a band you don't like. You might eat fried catfish that's not so great tasting but it was made for you by them. There's a long list of things you might do because you care. Some say love is hard to define but I think it's pretty easy. Love is simply your desire to place the needs of others above your own. Real people love. I wish to know more about this cat movie, please. Someone's destined to be an insult until their attitude changes.